Good morning, students. Today we are going to see this question, which is nothing but to calculate the area of the square. This is our question that we are going to discuss today in this class or in this program. Please try to see; it's a very simple program. You can see the formula is given here: area equal to length into length. That means if you want to find the area of the square, it is what area equal to length into length area equal to length into length now with this given situation it becomes so easy for you to do everything clearly i will tell you now you can see here there are two lengths it doesn't mean that you have to get two inputs it is enough if you get only one input which is length because both are same most of the times our students get confused with this idea there are two lengths so length one time and length second time no need to get because it is going to be the same value when the value is going to be same no need to get two inputs it is enough if you can get one input and you can see that the other one is area the which is going to be our output so now let's go to visual basic to design our screen so file new project window form application by default then you open the new window for you now you can see here you have everything ready with you so now what you can do is that you can try to go and like for example i am going to place the toolbox which is text box as i told you before there is only one input in this program and after that i am going to copy it i am going to paste it so text box 1 is for input and text box 2 is for output now i have a button here i have a button here then you can see here i have a label i place the label in the top label 1 right click copy i am going to paste it label 2 and label 3 see the label 3 i am placing it here label 2 i am placing it here so you see you see this is the whole design that i need because this this labels are to name labeling you know labeling the content or the the elements which you have placed or the controls that you have placed okay labeling them button is normally or mostly used for process which you have seen in any like click okay that's like a process will happen mostly the buttons are used for process then you see this is a input and this is going to be my output now in the label 1 if you can see here i am writing it here in the top enter uh, this is for what area of square let me put it down as area of square so you see this has changed as area of square now i am not very happy with the font i go to the same font see i make it bold i can increase my size of this one to 22 for example now you see it has become area of square button 1 for example i want to change it as i go to where text property i go to text property and i change it as what area area of square area of square label 2 i am changing it as enter the length length or just you can give length also no problem enter the length whatever is the length enter it here here the output will be what area area is the output that you are going to have so now you will get this input you will press this button to make the process and you will get the output here now i click on this button here i write here text box 2 dot text equal to where of text box 1 dot text why the value in the text box 1 is actually the length and then again put multiply because length into length that means what you put it one more time here text box 1 dot text 
length into length because it's the value you got in text box 1. So put it two times text box 1 dot text into text box 1 dot text. Where you are getting it? You are getting it in the text box 2. Now you can run it. I enter the length 6. The area of the square is 36. Now you can see here this is the input, this is the output, this is the process. Use this output I got in 36, the area, text box 2, text box 1 into text box 1, I got the answer. So now I stop the program code, save the program, save all and I choose here area of square, area of square and I save the program. I hope it's clear for you until now and if you have any question you can ask me in the class. Thank you.